Danielle. What's up, my friend? Dean Summerhalder here. Hey, hey, yeah, I know they always talk about us. Hey, is that he really doing too much? Talk too much online too much. I got me a record player and didn't wrap it. I didn't have any wrapping paper at work. It sold out. Honey, there was a bunch in my closet. I didn't know that. Aw, this is so cute. Oh, Gucci. Is that all in here? Okay. This is different. It's not wrapped this year. It's just bags. Oh, a purse. Oh, slides, I guess. Oh, these are so cute. So this is one of your last presents, it's on my phone, but there's one more present coming that didn't come in time, but close your eyes before you open it. I knew it, Ian Summerhalder. Danielle, what's up my friend, Dean Summerhalder here, AKA Damon Salvatore. So a little birdie named your mom told me that you are crushing life right now and that there are some pretty wild complexities uh, in what you do. And I will tell you, social interaction on social media is 
a very interesting dynamic that we have created in the modern world and sometimes it can be difficult to navigate so kudos to you for kicking butt at the level in which you're doing it and there are really good people out there um, and then there are people out there that just aren't happy and that want to not say kind or nice things to you and I just want to remind you when someone's mean to you I know you're old enough to know this, but when someone's mean to you, or they do not kindly or thoughtfully toward you, it has nothing to do with you. They're unhappy for some other reason in their life. Maybe they're going through a breakup, or they're in a fight with their parents, or they just lost someone they love, or they got bad grades, or they lost a job. Something happened to them. So it's nothing to do with you. So try not to spend even a moment of this precious life worrying about what they say. That's a big, big, big thing. And I just want to remind you of that, but I know you know that. Merry Christmas, congratulations, and thank you for being a supporter. Thank you for watching what I do. It means the world. Good luck out there. Keep kicking butt. Congratulations and Merry Christmas. Aww. Because Danny's boyfriend texted me. Once you get your Oculus login, let me know so I can buy you the, what do you call it? Star Wars game, hell yeah. I sent her the Z series, she bought the X series, so I had to bring it back to the Amazon store and return it, but now I got the Z series. And no one's gonna know. I know no one's gonna know, but it's so I can put a little character on there, on my computer. That, that's the only reason I wanted it. Hell yeah. And then I know what this is because Danny just told me she opened her hoodie. I don't think this is Hot Wheels, Danny. Well, maybe it is. I'm very confused. I don't think so. It is Hot Wheels. Hot Wheels. Boy, it is. I was not you expecting this. Did you Summer Holder said Danielle? Because I saw him right there. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That was cool. Oh, some pants. Hell yeah. <sighs> Those are not those pants, so those shorts. Shorts, my bad. I was yeah. expecting pants. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Danielle here back with another video, and today we're gonna do a Christmas haul. I know you guys look forward to my Christmas <laughs> videos every single year. Um, and this year I'm doing it a little bit different. I didn't record me opening all my presents, just a couple of them, and I'm gonna actually haul them after I open them. Because, I don't know, I feel like I just like really wanted to enjoy Christmas this year instead of like recording me, because I always do that for you guys, but I was like, you know what, like, this year I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna like, enjoy, you know what I mean? So, I'm gonna start off with this, because this is like a very interesting gift, and it's like probably not something that a lot of people ask for, but I asked for it. So anyways, this is from my uncle, and it's a pedicure spa, and I am obsessed with pedicures, if you know me, I want to get a pedicure like every other day. So I bought this like in-home pedicure kit and I got this one. And it's like a heated pedicure little tub thing. And like I love like giving my friends pedicures and just like things like that. You know, like I love like having little spa days with my friends in my house. So, well, my friends. I mean like probably a friend. <laughs> yeah. Um, and then I'm going to go with like the big things first. And then I'm going to like go to like kind of like the clothes and like the littler items, you know. Oh no, these are falling. Okay, so I got a record player and I really, really wanted to get like a bunch of different records so I could start, you know, like playing records. Sorry, something fell. Okay, but anyways, my brother got me this. And it's this record player and isn't it so cool? What a good brother. Chad never gets me gifts. I was very surprised. He actually like, got me gifts this year. I was like, wow, Chad. But yeah. Um, okay, and then these are from Talene. She had got me, she gave them to me a little bit before, but I wanted to save them so I could show them on Christmas. She got me this bath bomb set, and then she got me these pore strips. And I actually, oh, freak, I left it over there. Let me grab it. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. 
Also, I don't know why I'm freaking s Everyone's sick on Christmas. I'm literally sick on Christmas, but it's not COVID because I, I got COVID tested. I'm vaccinated also, and I know, like, obviously being vaccinated doesn't mean you can't get COVID. I know that, but I got a COVID test, and I was still negative, so I'm not, I don't have COVID. I just have some type of cold or something. Okay, so <laughs> anyways, so they got me this, which is so pretty. It's this Michael Kors little, like, heart bracelet. And then she got me these matching earrings to it, which I thought were so cute. And I love that. She's such a good friend. And then, now we're going to move on. So that's what Celine got me. Thank you, Celine. I love you so much. Then I have this. This is what my mom got me, a Prada purse, a.k.a. Santa. I have been wanting this, like, little Prada nylon. Is that what it's called, nylon? I think it's called the nylon. But I have been wanting this for so long. I just, like never got it and i got it for christmas and i was so thankful for that and then with that being said like all of the records i got this one is nickelback this one is red hot chili peppers i love them so actually my brother used to have a record player and then his broke so he gave me like some of his old records too and i guess this is little pump <laughs> i don't really listen to little pump but i mean it's cool it's a cool record then we have lincoln park love them and honestly some of these i don't really know who these are my brother just gave them to me because they're like his old ones but then we have this one which i love one of her songs this is rita rita ora i think rita ora i'm pretty sure and i love one of her songs they're like my favorite that's also one of my brothers that it gave to me then we have dua lipa very very cool that's also one of my brothers but then for christmas i got a halsey one very very cool and then I got a pair of more one. And those were all the records for my mom and then the ones that my brother gave me. And then Mason for Christmas. This is what he got me. He got me this Adele record and the Olivia Rodrigo record. And then um, a blanket, a heated blanket. But it's not here yet. He said we'll get here after Christmas. Um, so those were all my records. And that's what Mason got me for Christmas. And then for Christmas, I got Mason. Um, he's like really into gaming. So I bought him um, like a gaming chair. It's so cute. I'll show you guys um, a gaming chair. And then I got him like 3D panels to like hang up all over his little gaming room. It was so cute. But yeah. And then we have this, which, okay. So you guys are going to see some clips of me this morning and you're going to be like, she looks dead. I did not feel good at all. But like after the day went on, I took some medicine. I feel better now. But this morning I was like, ah, so like I looked a little bad. But anyways, this necklace I have been looking at, I want to put it on actually. I have been going to this mall since I moved to Calabasas and every single freaking day I go there I look at this necklace and I was just like oh I want it so bad it's so beautiful like it's literally just the most beautiful necklace ever and I have just been wanting it forever and I finally got it and every time I walk by it I just want it so bad I remember I like begged everyone like for this necklace like there was a point in time i was begging mason mason was like no so then i started begging my mom how do you wear these like two necklaces every day so this is just gonna get like added to the group so hopefully it like sits in there really nicely oh i love it okay let me like let me look at like a closer look yes so pretty like it's just like so and then it looks so like pretty like that too like oh so beautiful it literally is like the most beautiful necklace ever now we're gonna get to clothes so i got a lot of clo clothes if you couldn't tell but the first one i'm gonna open is this bikini i'm gonna show you guys that so this is a dior bikini i've never owned a dior bikini and i'm very excited because this is so freaking cute the bottoms look a little big they're a medium though and i'm always a size medium but they look really big like they're bigger than my face so hopefully they fit me if not we can always like you know exchange it for the right size but the top does look like it's gonna fit and i think the top is so freaking cute and then it came with this cute little bag and honestly i'm probably gonna use it for like travel or like to put jewelry in because it's really cute and it's dior so free dior bag basically then i got this this is just like kind of like a random hoodie it's from broken promises and it's like um a casper one and that was really cute it was cute 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 then here here's some exciting stuff at least for me i love one tree hill 
just like I love Vampire Diaries. If you guys saw my little Vampire Diaries gift where Ian Summerholder sent me a cameo, that was also one of my gifts, which is in another video I like posted about it. But my mom got me this Tree Hill varsity jacket and it has Lucas's number on the back with Scott. Lucas Scott, I'm wearing his varsity jacket, what? I love Lucas, literally could be my husband. Then his hoodie, Keith Scott Motors. And it's so freaking cute. And then the front is just gray. You know, how Lucas always wears it in the beginning. And then I'm going to try this on for you guys because I want to see how it fits. But I have been in love with Versace robes for the longest time. And I've just always wanted one. But I always just like wear my cheap robe from Target when I get out of the shower. But my mom surprised me with one for Christmas. So, let's see. It's a little big. Also, don't mind how messy my room is. I know, I literally leave for a road trip tomorrow and I still have to pack tonight. So it's just gonna get messy. But look at this, it's so like luxury and just beautiful. Just wow, it's so, it's just so beautiful. And it comes with like the thing um, to tie it to. And then she also got me this, which if you guys know, if you guys watch when she heal, I'm sure you guys know about this it's like the bracelet that he gave to Haley and I did get this keychain that says go brook yourself <laughs> if you guys also watch one tree hill you guys would know I don't know where that went I think it like fell somewhere or maybe it's like still downstairs I don't know we'll find it though and then I got this which is this bathing suit but I didn't want it as a bathing suit I wanted it as like a bodysuit because it's so cute it's like this Versace um, like bikini, well, one piece, but I'm gonna wear it as a bodysuit. But it's so cute, literally so cute. And then I got these. This is the last gift. These are the North Face X Gucci. I love them. Like, they look like teddy bear slippers. They're so cute. Like, can we just talk about that? So cute. I love them. Um, that's all my gifts for this 2021 Christmas. Yeah, I will see you guys next time for Christmas 2022 to explain all my gifts to you. This is definitely like a yearly thing. And I mean, I don't know, guys. If you guys want me to record while I get my gifts, let me know. I just did it differently this year, you know, just to see, you know, what it was like. Um, but I am totally down for whatever you guys like more. So let me know in the comments. And thank you so much for watching. Um, I love you guys all so much. And Merry Christmas, even though this isn't going up on Christmas, but... You know, you get it. Merry Christmas. And I'm so thankful for all of you. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye. Love you. Mwah.